Hello, and welcome to this video highlighting the newest features available in the CN Maestro Cloud 3.2.0 release. The 3.2.0 release of CN Maestro for Cloud is now available. This release includes support for the NSC 3000 security appliance, a new assist feature for PMP devices, support for the Cambium Edge controller and PTP 820 and 850 devices, support for CN Wave 5G fixed devices, CN Wave 60 GHz network map topology, wireless flood attack detection, and honeypot access point detection. Also included in this release is support for the XE 3-4TN access point which is a tri-radio, tri-band, Wi-Fi 6E outdoor access point with N-type connectors, so it will utilize external antennas. This outdoor access point is designed to excel in outdoor environments and will also be very effective in warehouses or convention centers or any other environment where the AP will be placed 40 to 50 feet above the floor. The external antennas can be used to focus the RF energy down to the clients, whereas internal omnidirectional antennas struggle to do this. This new release of CN Maestro allows you to configure, monitor, and manage Cambium's new NSE 3000 Secure WAN Edge solution. Using CN Maestro, you will be able to onboard the new NSE 3000 you will also be able to configure security and network settings, and using the CN Maestro dashboard, you will be able to monitor the performance of the NSC appliance, client sessions, performance, and review notifications. Using CN Maestro, configuration and management of the NSC 3000 appliance is very simple using NSE groups. To configure the NSC appliance, Either create a new NSE group or open an existing NSE group. The NSE group allows you to configure parameters such as management, including the admin password and primary and secondary DNS servers, the time zone and NTP servers, and syslog servers. And on the network page, you can apply filters to the LAN ports, VLANs, and you can configure static routes. The WAN page allows you to configure both WAN ports, the IP mode, load balancing between the two WAN ports. You can configure uplink and downlink capacity. You can create traffic shaping rules and also perform a WAN speed test. The firewall page allows you to create layers 2, 3, and 4 firewall rules and enable protection against denial of service attacks. The Threat Protection page allows you to enable IDS and IPS modes and apply DNS-based filters. The VPN and RADIUS server page allows you to configure the appliance as a VPN server and as a RADIUS server. And the User Defined Overrides page gives you CLI access to commands that are not exposed in CN Maestro. Once the NSE is onboarded and active, you can select the device in the network tree and you will be able to review KPIs with status, throughput, and client and VPN session information. There are also charts and graphs showing the numbers of threats, threats by category, threats by geolocation, top vulnerabilities, top vulnerable clients, and historical graphs for WAN ports 1 and 2 throughput and the numbers of clients and VPN sessions. You can also go to the Security Vulnerabilities page to drill down into the vulnerabilities in both network and client devices. If you click on a vulnerability identifier, you will be redirected to a description of the vulnerability on the National Institute of Standards and Technologies website. With this CN Maestro release, Cambium Networks is introducing Assists. This is a solution for monitoring the health of a Cambium network and remediates detected issues. 
Assis scans the network configuration every 24 hours and generates an Assist score. CN Maestro evaluates specific issues that might occur during the device deployment and summarizes the scores and results of the findings at the system, network, tower, and device level. Recommended remediation actions are provided. The assist scores are shown in percentage values and allows users to isolate issues in the configuration of their infrastructure devices. This release adds assist functionality for Cambium PMP devices. Future CN Maestro releases will extend assists to other Cambium products. You will find the assists page by going to monitor and manage and looking at the system, network, tower, or device level pages. To narrow your focus on a certain set of assists, you are able to filter the devices using status, severity, title, category, or group criteria. Click the failed or past tiles to narrow the focus of the page to only the devices that currently match the selected criteria. Click on the title of any of the assists entry to drill down into the information. You will be redirected to the devices page that has a description of the item. The details page will offer a recommended remediation action. With this release, CN Maestro adds new monitoring and manage functionality for the new Edge controller and PTP 820 and 850 devices. To access the new Edge controller, go to Network Services and Edge Controller. Open your existing Edge controller to access the dashboard, configuration, tools, and monitoring pages. The dashboard provides information about the Edge Controller and the PTP 820 and 850 devices. The Configuration page discovers the 820 and 850 devices. You can also blacklist the devices and you can apply templates. The Tools page provides Diagnostics, Operations, and Services. The Monitoring page displays performance on the controller's CPU utilization and load, process activity, memory usage, swap usage, and file system information. CN Maestro provides for management and monitoring of CNWay 5G fixed devices. Management tools include onboarding, a dashboard, configuration, details, notifications, performance graphs, statistics, software updates, and reports. CN Maestro will discover the 60 GHz CN Wave network and create a comprehensive detailed network topology. Only nodes operating in responder mode will be detected. Customer nodes with an established wireless link will not be detected, and offline nodes with a configured channel override will not be detected on a different channel. To start a topology scan, go to the network tree, locate and select the site you want to scan. Go to the maps page for the site, and under details, click the three dots next to a device and select topology scan. And then click start topology scan to initiate the scan. The results will show discovered nodes that are not included in the topology. Add the node to the topology by clicking the Add Node to Topology button. Complete the Add Node to Topology Details page and click Save. Adding another layer of security to your wireless network. CN Maestro provides wireless flood attack detection to monitor and detect association, authentication, disassociation, deauthentication, 
and EAP flood attacks on your wireless network. At the site level in the network tree, the WIDS page has charts with information on Honeypot APs. To configure WIDS in your system, open an existing AP group or create a new AP group and go to the security page. Enable the wireless intrusion detection system. Configure the number of packets per minutes that need to be detected before an event is triggered and select the type of wireless flood attack that you want to monitor and detect. At the site level in the network tree, the WIDS page has charts with information on Honeypot APs. Okay, this concludes this video highlighting the newest features in CN Maestro 3.1.2. Thank you for your time and have a great day.